Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Scorpio for love and relationship for the month of July Hmm? Money is very important at this time for you. It seems to be that you are working and what's coming for you is extra work over time. Or you are expanding into another business or another job. Like, you know, it could be taking another job. But it looks to me here that you have been really, like, you not know, trying to cover these loans or money that you borrowed just like you know for you to earn money but money is going to be good it's coming up you are back and forth about someone from your past you want someone or desire someone from your past even though that you are working on another relationship and that relationship like you know into your grasp at this time Coming like you know, for you, this person that he or she desire you. There is a conflict between you two and that person is always forgiven. Sometimes they feel that you want to let them go because you are being like you know, back and forth about really getting your point through to this person. This person understands you very well. They value you, they love you, they care for you a lot. This person is in love with you. They are happy with you. Happy. Look at that happiness. They think and believe that you are the one. They want to be with you. But it feels to me here that you want to find out more about them. You want to see like you know, what's going on. Some of you are making like you know maybe some spells, candles, whatever it is to be really like you know, working. Some of you. You are stressed out. You jump into conclusions. You want to change things like you know, between you and this other person. You feel like you know, that you are frustrated, you are angry, you want to accomplish something with this person, and it feels here like you know the other person, well, everything is fine. What's wrong with you? What's happening? What's wrong? And you are like, no, not the way. You are just trying to succeed with this person. Someone is going to tell you a lie about something. Maybe to be really doing, really to trash this person around you or reputation and you're going to believe it. There are lies and these lies are not really good. Don't listen to this crap. You know, somebody is really telling you something. Somebody is telling, jumping into conclusions, trying to succeed in damaging you or stress you out and making you unhappy. Be careful about that. Someone is trying to be really making you like to you know, change your direction and walk away from the person that you love and want. So they tell you here, like, you no, know, don't believe everything you hear. You have to get to know your person for you to be really pointing your finger on them or not. You feel like you know, that you want really to just walk away from this relationship and find someone else. This person love you and care for you and they are not caring and they are not lying. So you need to be really understanding their method, the way they are. And it seems to be they have been really the way they are for a long time. This person actually proposed to you. Some of you like numerate to this person. Some of you like no have been together for a long time and they are really like no into you and proposed to you already. And everything like no seems like no going very well. But I get here that you yell, the other person yell. You bad mouth the other person, they are doing the same thing. Both of you are stressed out at this moment, but it feels to me it's going to work out eventually. So you need to calm your emotions and believe your person because someone made you not really happy. 
Mm. You just want to walk away and shut the door. But it says here, you need to be patient. Anyway, your person feel that you are the one. They want you, but they think that you are walking away maybe because you desire someone else. And they don't really want to see you with someone else. You said something. I can't be with someone else. I can't really choose another guy, another woman. Stop it. Okay. You are holding on each other. You love each other very much. I see that. You just want to be happy. You want to be happy. You want to be married. You want to be really like, you know, just giving like, you know, really that trust between you and this person. You want this person to speak up because your person like, you know, sit around and say like, you know, everything is fine. I don't have to be a really bragging about my love, my emotions to you. And they are not really expressing their feeling and you read between lines and you want to see like, you know, what the other person up to, but you don't see anything to read. Like, you know, just you feel maybe they want on vacation or want out of town for business or work or to visit family. Maybe they just fooled around or did something with someone else. And no, this person is holding on you so strong. He or she is relaxed. They like to drink, they like to have fun with their friends, family, people. But I get here they are spending a lot and they need to watch their spending and they are getting the help also, but they need you more than you need them financially. Mm. It's really too much into it. Mm. You want to find out, like, you know, about this person, if they are fooling around, doing something, you, you are trying to watch here and there, but you rush into saying things that is not there. The other person is not easy also. They, they have a sharp tongue when it, when it comes to defending themselves. There is someone from your past is really approaching you and coming back in the picture. Someone that you let go. But they want you and they desire you, desire you right now. It's kind of like more that they want really commitment. They want to push you away from the current relationship for you to be with them seriously. It's not really just to play around or have fun. This person is serious also. There is more than one in your reading. And you are like, oh, I don't know what to do. Some of you, like, you know, uh, uh, another person that you love, like, you know, they have someone else or involved in marriage or relationship also is trying to approach you to be with you to have fun and a good time. Anyway, unfinished business between you and the current relationship. And this person can be really selfish sometimes. And I get here that they want you to hold back on any other relationships and be with them. And not really to make that choice or has the decision or not to go and say, I want divorce if you are married or I want to split this relationship if you are in commitment. They don't want you to choose another person. But the one from the past coming to you wants you to make that choice because they want you for themselves. So you choose whom you want. It's up to you. But I see the person that you are attacking at this current time. This is the person that you are currently in a relationship. This is the person who really love you the most. And they care for you a lot. And they value you. But they are not talking about it. I know there is a conflict here, but it's going to work out. Okay? By itself. Best of luck for you, dear Scorpio. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. The link for my website is below this video mysticalaziza.com after you click on reading prices please purchase your reading then give me a call the phone number is listed on my website I don't work Saturday and Sunday on the 25th of this July I will be taking a vacation for one week I will be back to take private readings 
on the 2nd of August. But the whole month till the 25th, before the 25th, till the 24th, I will be taking calls, private readings right now in July. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.